there are different types of errors which occurs in fire application you might have already encountered some of the different types of errors in fire application today in this particular video we'll see like how to fix the error code 530502 on fire application okay so you all know that fire is a popular multiplayer modification for a grand theft v it allows players to enjoy customized gameplay experiences on private servers servers okay so one such error in fire is fire error code 502 the complete error states that could not fetch c hyphen greater than s authentication ticket that is http hypertext transfer protocol 502 so we'll see like what causes this fire error code 502 the fire 502 error is an http status code that indicates that problem with communication between servers on the internet it occurs when the server receives an invalid or incomplete response from other server okay so one common cause of the error is server overload so if the server is overloaded this can happen so it says that which can happen with fiam server is overwhelmed with high volume of requests or resource intensive modification okay suppose if the server receives too many number of requests on fire application so this is one of the reason which causes fire error code 502 okay so here you can see the exact screenshot of the error could not fetch c hyphen greater than s authentication ticket http 502 so it says that the network conjunction can also contribute to the occurrence of the error disrupting data flow between servers and resulting the invalid response so you got to know like what causes this error so now we'll see like how you can fix or how you can overcome the 5m status code 502 okay so the first method how to overcome this problem or the error is to check the internet connection so just verify you are having a proper internet connection with a good bandwidth and a good speed suppose if you are having a bad bandwidth or the bad internet connection then definitely you will face this kind of error 5m status code or 5g okay so ensure that you have stable and reliable internet connection so if you want to check the, if you are having a proper internet connection or not then what you can do is like you can just check the cable connections to the router and modem whatever the cable and wire is connected to the router or the modem if there is a, any loose loose connection or if there is any problem with the cable means like definitely you will face the internet connection okay so the best the better way is like to check all the cables connected to the router and modem it's always better to uh, switch off and switch on the router if you are facing any kind of internet issues that that will reset your router and the modem so that you can start using your internet connection okay so again if the problem first persists as i told you like you can re reset your network settings on your this device so what you can do is like you can go to the network settings menu and look for an option on the reset or restart the network settings if you are using your wi-fi try switching to the wired connection to rule out any potential wireless issues okay suppose if you are using a wi-fi internet connection and there will be another option also like where you can directly connect the wire to your laptop or system so that you will not face any kind of internet issues okay and finally you can restart or uh, you can restart your router or a modem for the better to refresh the connection okay 
And the second method, how you can overcome that error is by checking the Fiam server status. So what you can do is like you can directly go to this Fiam server website. You can check whether is there any, whether if there is any issues with the server or not. Okay, so determine if the Fiam server is experiencing any known issues or undergoing any maintenance. If the server is down or undergoing maintenance, 502 error is likely to be temporarily and you can try again later. Okay, so if there is any undergoing maintenance or if there is any temporary issues or if there is any undergoing maintenance, is there means it will be updated here. If it is updated as some kind of maintenance or uh, undergoing maintenance or temporary issues like it will be updated here so then you need not worry then probably you can try after some time so that it will start working okay suppose if there is any if there is any issues with the server like undergoing maintenance or temporary issues means then only it will be updated here if it is not having any temporary uh, or undergoing or ongoing under maintenance means it will not be updated here it will just be mentioned as no incidents reported okay so and the third method is like you can connect different servers using fiam console by putting the accurate server details you bypass any potential issues related to the server this workaround has worked for many users however it is important to know that this may not work for all the users okay see uh, the thing is like when you are trying to connect to the different servers using fiam console everyone will not be knowing like how to connect it to the different servers using fiam console okay so i will tell you the best way like how you can connect to the different servers using fiam client console is by open the console by pressing the f8 button on your keyboard paste the command connect server ip colon server port in the console and replace the server ip with the actual ip address and server port with the correct port number of the server then press enter to initiate the connection attempt okay so this is the way where you can connect to the different server using 5m client console the fourth method is by trying again later okay if there is any problem with the server or if there is any undergoing maintenance or if there is any temporary issues means like whatever the method you tried it may not be working out what you can do is like you can try after some time maybe due to like temporary issues or due to high traffic or due to too many users trying to attempt to connect like that may not that may also be a problem so due to high traffic you might experience these kind of errors so what you can do is like you can wait for some time and you can try later. okay the fifth method how you can overcome this problem is by contacting the fiam support team so there is a website there is an official support team where you can directly contact fiam support team like that is by support.cfx.com okay and the other method is like you can just directly copy paste it in google you can just click on this sub submit a request here you can select what are the options you want to select which is near to your proper you can select it and you can raise the request so that the support team will solve your issues okay so this is how you can overcome the problem on error code 502 so we saw what are the causes and we also saw like how to fix the error code 502